<laughs> oh, sorry, Toot. <gasps> oh, wowie zowie puddle. What a mess. I know. I'll clean it up as soon as I find my lucky four-leaf clover. Shouldn't you be practicing for the tournament, Puds? After all, you are last year's beanbag toss champion. That's why I'm looking for my lucky clover. What does your lucky clover have to do with the beanbag toss, Puddle? Everything! I had my lucky clover in my pocket when I won the beanbag toss last year. So? So that's why I won! My lucky clover gave me good luck. If I don't have it with me this year, I can't win. What are you talking about, Puds? Clovers don't win beanbag tosses. Great beanbag tossing does. But I've always had it before even when I practiced. Without it, I just feel like I can't do it. Oh, it's got to be somewhere. <clears throat> One, two, three. <sighs> That's not enough. What are you doing now, Puddle? I'm looking for another four-leaf clover, but I can only find ones with three leaves. Four-leaf clovers are very hard to find. Well, you'll be lucky if you find one. <laughs> That's probably why people say they bring good luck. <laughs> well, I guess my luck has run out. You don't need luck, Puddle. You probably just need more practice. Come on. Let's go, Puddle. Let's go. Try again, Puddle. Just throw harder this time. Ah, whoa! Oh. It's okay, Puddle. Here, I'll hold your arm, and you can fish it out. Whoa! Huh? Whoa! Ah. Oh, I told you my luck had run out. Well, at least we got the beanbag back to practice with. <laughs> Howdy, neighbors. How's the beanbag throwing going, champ? Not that great, Otto. Puddle's having trouble with his beanbag tossing. Mm-hmm. You know, I've got some movies I took of last year's tournament at home. Why don't you come over and have a look? Maybe it will help remind you of what you did to win. Whoa! That's a great idea, Otto. I guess it couldn't hurt. Yeah! Yeah! Look, Puddle. See how great you were last year? And here goes Puddle in the final throw. Can he do it? It'll take concentration, skill, and maybe a little bit of luck. Looks like Puddle has a good luck charm with him, just in case. And he does it! A perfect score! Puddle is Woodcock Pocket Beanbag Toss Champion! Yeah! See? I had my lucky clover with me last year. That's why I won. 
I think it had more to do with believing you could do it than having a clover in your pocket, Puddle. Well, that's what I've been telling him all along. He can do it. Well, I guess if I practice some more, maybe I'll feel like I can do it. That's the spirit, Buds. Why don't you take these beanbags to practice with? I was a bit of a beanbag tosser myself back in the day. <gasps> Puddle. Uh, better get some sleep uh, if you're going to be rested and ready for the tournament tomorrow. Oh, what's the use? I'll never be ready anyway. So, do you feel ready for the tournament now, Puddle? Yeah, I don't really feel any different. But thanks anyway, Otto. Doctor. Hi, Dr. Hassong. Hello, Toot, Puddle. I'm off to the beanbag toss tournament. Shouldn't you be headed that way, too? Mm-hmm. Well, you don't sound all that excited about it, considering you were last year's champion. Puddle doesn't feel like he can win this year, because I lost my lucky clover. I had it with me last year when I won, and it always made me feel like a winner. Hmm. You know, I may have just the thing for you right here. This is my favorite coin that I carry with me wherever I go. Would you like to borrow it? Gee willikers! Thanks, Dr. Hassong! This must be his lucky coin. Maybe it'll work just like my clover. Try it out. Okay, that's one out of three for Fred Fox. Yay! Yeah! Fred! Yay! Now let's see what Puddle can do. That's two for Puddle, and he wins the round! Two to one! Yeah, oh, Puddle! Puddle! <laughs> Thanks for a great game! Puddle needs another perfect score to wrap it up. Yeah! 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 Oh, yeah! One more to win. Can he do it? Dr. Hassong, I couldn't have won without it. Lucky? 
I never said it was lucky. It's just one of my favorite coins. But... You just needed to feel like you could do it, Pado. You mean I didn't need your lucky coin or my lucky clover? Mm -mm. <gasps> Wait! It's not even here! I really did do it all on my own! All my practicing paid off! Travel far away, but they won't be gone for long. A boomerang flies, but always returns home where it belongs. Flam a friend, flam a friend, that while you're away, I'll be thinking about two each and every day. I will laugh and play in the winds that blow. Are my friends, are you ready? Come, let's go. Boomerang, boomerang, fly, little boomerang, 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 as you roam. Boomerang, boomerang, fly away, boomerang, 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 then come. my forward rolls. <laughs> I can see that. But shouldn't you be getting ready for our trip? Well, I got up early, made breakfast, did all the packing, and watered all the flowers. Now, I'm just waiting for you. Oh. Well, I'm sure lucky to have a best friend like you, Puddle. Did you leave anything for me to do? Sure. There'll be lots for you to do in New York City, especially when we get here. Wowie zowie! We're going to the Hayden Planetarium? Oh, I've been to New York City before, but I've never made it to the planetarium. I've always really wanted to go. I know how much you like learning about the stars and the moon, Toot, and that's what their new show is all about. You're amazing, Puds. I wish there was something special I could do for you. I'm just happy to see how excited you are, Toot. We're going to have a blast! That's our taxi, buddy. Then it's off to the airport we go to catch our plane to New York City! Welcome to New York City, USA. We hope you've enjoyed your flight. There's so many things to see and do, whether it's day or night. In the center of the city is Central Park, a very fun place to be. And don't forget to take a ferry to the Statue of Liberty. Let's hurry, Toot. I think it's starting very soon. Two tickets to the new Moon and Stars show, please. I'm very sorry, but that show doesn't open until tomorrow. Doesn't? Aw, Thunderbugs! This was supposed to be my treat for my great friend. What are we gonna do now? Yeah, pardon me for interrupting, uh, but since you two are such special friends, did you know New York City is home to one of the most famous friendship gifts ever? Really? What is it? Well, if you're looking to make a fun day of it, how about I give you a hint, and then you can try to figure it out? Well, that sounds like a swell idea. Are you ready? Uh-huh. This special friendship gift is on its very own tiny island. Oh, that's a great clue. Thanks. Now let's see if we can figure it out. From what I remember, there's a big lake and a few small ponds in Central Park. Maybe we'll find an island there. <gasps> Come on, pal. Let's go check it out. 
<laughs> Are you seeing any tiny islands, Puddle? Not yet. But it sure is great to have this big park right in the middle of the busy city. Ha! <laughs> Look at that huge green hill! What a perfect place for tumbling! Let's go! But I thought we were trying to find the special friendship gift. We will. But if my best friend wants to take time to tumble, I think that's what we should do. Yahoo! <laughs> this is the most gigantic lawn I've ever seen. <laughs> and we're gonna get to tumble all the way down the hill. Ready, set, go! <gasps> Carousel. Oh, it sure would be neat to take a ride. Well, why can't we? Don't you want to keep looking for the special friendship gift? Sure. But you stopped to tumble with me, buddy. So I want to ride the carousel with you. It was a great carousel ride, wasn't it? I'll say. If I remember right, the lake is right over this hill. You were right, Toot. There's an island right out there. Well, I don't see any special friendship gift on it. Do you, Puddle? And not only that, but look! The island is moving! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, I guess it wasn't what we were looking for after all. Nope, but the ticket seller did say the special friendship gift is very famous, and it's on a tiny island all its own. Excuse huh? me, did I hear you say you were looking for our city's most famous friendship gift? Uh-huh. A fellow gave us the hint that it's on its own island, and we're trying to find it. What a fun game. Would you like another hint? Oh, yeah, you bet! The special friendship gift you're searching for is very tall and green. Good luck. Oh, oh there are plenty of tall, colorful <gasps> buildings in Times Square, Puds. I think we should go look there. I'm with you. Let's go. Wow, there's definitely a lot to look at here. I'll say. But... I'm still not seeing any special friendship gift. Especially not one that's tall and green and on its very own island. Did I huh? hear you fellas right? You're looking for our city's most famous friendship gift? Yep. We've been following hints all day. Would you like one more? For sure. Absolutely. Okay, okay, okay. She's a lovely lady wearing a crown. I know what it is. What, Toot? Tell me. Come on, pal. I'd rather show you. Thanks! Hurry, Puddle. I want to make sure we don't miss the last boat. Boat? Yup. Follow me. <gasps> it's the Statue of Liberty we're going to see. Right you are. There she is. On her very own Liberty Island. The Statue of Liberty was made in France and given to the people of the United States as a special gift of friendship. The Americans were very grateful and promised to always take care of it. Gee willikers! America and France sure are special friends, aren't they, Toot? Just like you and me. Excuse me, sir. Would you please take a picture of me and my friend? Oh, certainly. Hey, stand over here so we can get Lady Liberty in there, too. So, what's your favorite part of our trip to New York City, Puddle? Getting to share it with my oh. very best friend. 
Me too. The guidebook says the seven rays of her crown are in honor of the world's seven seas and seven continents. Wow! And her torch is a bright light to welcome everybody who comes here. Oh, look, buds. There's the moon. And some stars, too. So guess what, Toot? We're getting to see a wonderful moon and stars show after all. And this one's the real thing. We saw great sights, we made new friends. Now we're heading home as our journey ends. That picture sure is the perfect friendship gift. Ha, huh, Toot? Absolutely. And if you don't mind, there's one more thing I'd like from you, Puds. Huh? What's that? Please pass the maple syrup. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. You're welcome, pal. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.